Hi there. Like my fire? I like to cozy up next to a warm fire to keep me warm. I love how they smell, that we can use them to see at night, and then we can make s'mores with them. Have you ever been camping? Our family loves to go camping. We love being outside, building campfires, and eating s'mores. In addition to the sleeping bags and the marshmallows, one of the most important things we need to remember to pack is our flashlight. Why? Have you ever been outside at night? When you're camping, it gets really dark. If you have to make a trip to the bathroom in the middle of the night, you need to be able to see where you're going. You can't just flip the light switch on and walk to the bathroom. That flashlight also keeps you safe. Walking around in darkness can be dangerous. You need the flashlight to light your path so you don't wander into someone else's tent or trip and fall and hurt yourself. Can you imagine what it was like before electricity was invented? Once the sun went down, all people had to rely on was the moonlight. No flashlights, no lamps, maybe a candle. The moon is helpful, but it's not always bright enough to give enough light, and it's not always there. We need the dark to sleep, but to be productive, we need light. In today's message, Sean will talk about what it means to be the light of the world. In Bible times, they didn't have electricity or flashlights, just like when we go camping. So what does it mean to be the light of the world? In Exodus, when God led the Israelites out of Egypt, he gave them a floating pillar of fire to guide them at night because he knew that they wouldn't be able to see once the sun went down. Jesus also understood about darkness and he compared himself to a light in the middle of the night. Jesus said in John 8, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will not walk in darkness. Not only is Jesus light, but he wants us to be light too. In Matthew 5, Jesus says we are the light of the world and that we should let our light shine for others to see. Jesus is the light of the world. He is the light that shows us the way to God. And when we have Jesus in our hearts, we can be a light to others around us and also point them to God. How cool is that? And we don't need to worry about batteries or electricity because Jesus is the light that will never go out.